Okay, well, I found... Oh, it's still on the ground. I found what I wanted to find, which was this. Rip. But we may as well follow my, uh, marking. Dear. What are you up the to now? Another door! Okay, where is your master? Revelio. Uh, I don't think that's it. Where, where, where is the rest of you? Down, I assume, but hold on. These things look like doors. I swear, uh, keys. Oh, it is you. Hello. So one, four plus. Two equals six, so zero would be fat umpa lumpa. Okay. Five plus one equals six. We need eight not the five to get to eleven. Zero, one, two, three, four, five. Crabby spider looking thing. Revelio. Hogwarts architect. The Hogwarts architect shown here surrounded by the four house mascots. Oh yeah, he is too! Designed and oversaw the construction of Hogwarts Castle alongside founder Rowena Ravenclaw, who is credited with creating its ever-changing floor plan. There's me! Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Good view, Ignatia. You seem to tell me that on a, on a regular basis. Which is a little unnecessary. I keep forgetting the open outwards. Brush stroke scarf. And a purple toad statue. Oh, how divine. I mean, it's lovely. I'm just not really a scarf person. It doesn't get... Oh, hold on. It's got a slot. It's got a slot. <gasps> Plus five offense. And then, and then you go to F... And then you get rid of the bitch. Look at that. I am nailing this. Okay, 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 okay. On that note then. Okay, so I don't have anything better there. And we already equipped the better one there. In that case, there's the hand gear. Oh, it does. Hold on. Yeah, but that's got a slot. A trait slot. What's a trait slot level? I don't know. Put it on. And then get rid of it. Took me a while, but I figured out what I'm doing. Headwear. Oh. Oh. oh man. Alrighty. I see you. I see you. Increases my defense by two just by having eyewear. It seems like it would decrease my defense because if the glass shards get in my eyes, I injure myself. But whatever. Look at that. And my stats have gone up. I get it. I get it. I see you. I understand you. Uh, what is that? Oh, that's talk to Luke and Brattleby. Oh, but I've been given a main quest now. What main quest have I possibly been given? Weasley after class. Oh! Her classroom, which is off the Transfiguration Courtyard. She must be the Transfiguration. Then what is Fig? I don't know what... F is Fig Potions? I don't know. In any case, I would like to... I... Why is that that colour? Doesn't matter. We're going to the clock tower. I've been there before, so I can just go there straight away. I achieved what I set out to achieve. Alright. You. Can I help you? What? Are you a first year or something? Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinate duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. Okay, I, I get that they're probably hiring age-appropriate kids to do the voice acting, but when the students don't look their age, the voice coming out of that kid's mouth is just so wrong on so many levels. Um, I need to take a note. No, it's nice to hear. 
I'm flattered to hear that. Sebastian's not a bad duelist either. Imagine it's quite something to see the two of you duel. How does Cross One's work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end, he wins. He sounds like a first it's year. determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. But if he's organizing and duels, he's got to be at least up, third. The winner is awarded a prize. Interested? Absolutely. Of course. Just don't let me lose health points or I'll cry. Pastime. I agree. Besides, in crossed ones, you can duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, okay. care to step into the ring? Let's do it. I don't know Get many spells, but let's do Spectacular. it. Spectacular! Let the fireworks begin! Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, bloody hell, we're just getting we'll straight into it. Regret signing Astoria up. Cricket. Oh my god. Break through yellow shields with control spells like levitation spell Levioso. Target lock lets you track enemies without aiming. Okay. Okay. Look. Ow. Lawrence Davies has met his match. Hey now. I think we both struck her at the same time. Oh no, you did. Because mine's on. I was supposed to hit a button and I accidentally hit the correct button. I'm about to lose my health. But I don't care, I don't care, I don't care. Probably got to use the potion. How do I replenish my potions, by the way? Because I really didn't take any care for my health. Though. Nice work. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Can we Help just do in. single combat? I, I don't like multi combat. Now, Too much happening. To organize these duels, but check with me later. I may have something lined up for you. Okay. Again, Thanks. congratulations on your first cross. Thanks, buddy. Victory. I'm practically on death's door. Oh, good. It gives me health back. back We're fine. Sweet. Thanks, buddy. Round one complete. Crossed ones. Da -da -da -da. Complete side relationship quests. Oh, that's my new challenge. Um, well, I don't really know how to see if there are any side quests. I kind of thought they would appear, but nothing appears. So maybe there just aren't any yet. I don't know enough people. Oh, there's one way up there. Anywho, we are going here. So, without having anything there, the closest then would be Defense Against the Dark Arts. Of course, both my classes were in this tower or nearabouts, so of course she'd want to. Oh no, we're going outside her classroom, aren't we? Not my classroom. Okay, to tra the Transfiguration space. Rebellion. And we've already been here. Ooh, hello. Maybe not. Augury skeleton. This is a skeleton of an Irish phoenix, Augury. An intensely shy bird who can forecast the coming of rain and whose mournful cry was once believed to foretell death. Jesus, aren't you a ray of sunshine? I completely missed that earlier. Does one of these actually do something so I should keep touching them all? Revelio. Boom. Oh, she didn't talk to me. Safe. Might as well be surrounded by Jarvis. Oh, that's you. Hello. Oh, I was just looking at the painting. Painting of Ilias. Its painting depicts the young orphan wizard Ilias, who famously saved his entire village from an army of dementors, oh my god, and the dark wizard Raxidian by conjuring a mouse Patronus. Aww. That's so sweet. Aww. Anyway, not where we're going. We are actually going out here. My bad. Which is a nice Rebellion. courtyard. Yeah. 
Wyburn Fountain. This fountain is, this is, must be the courtyard, I mean there's probably lots of courtyards, but this could be the courtyard where uh, Moody turned Malfoy into a ferret? Was it a ferret? I don't remember. This fountain in the Transfiguration Courtyard has a likeness of a wyvern on top and serves as a relaxing place for students to gather. Despite rumours to the contrary, possibly started by Sir Cadigan, this is most assuredly not meant to be the wyvern of Y, slain by the lively knight in spite of himself. Level 5! And we haven't even finished the first main quest mission! What do you expect? Oh, it's down. My parents keep promising me something to make up for the fact that there's four months of the rock. I think we should tell them to put me out with a wind whisp. Wind whisp. Oh, right, Broom. I was listening. Better than to buy something from a child walking the streets of Hogsmeade. Little scallywag. Gold, they said it was. More like the work of a leprechaun. Stuff disappeared in a few hours. <laughs> Such a moonlight. Indeed you are. Makes no sense to me why Thirtyers don't study Abyssinian shrivel figs. Why should they escape the torment? Never seen Devil Snare in the wild. You don't want to. Absolutely. To I'm happy to read about it, mind. Don't get me started on how horrifying venomous tentacular are. Why we're forced to engage with them in class instead of just reading about them is beyond me. Why is that cat purring? Can you eat a Chinese oh, chomping she's just chilling. Not that I'm going to find out, mind you. My older brother used to terrorize me with a fang dream. You were going through topics really quickly, guys. Though I see all of it's revolving around plants. Because there are so many plants. Okay. How many owls do you think Hogwarts have? There's another flu network over here. Off on another adventure, are we? Always, my dear. Always. Weasley after class commenced. Oh, hello. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Hi, Deke. I have no oh, wonder. Uh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. Why is my wand out? I just smile awkwardly. I trust your first classes went well? Rather. They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me, isn't there? Hasn't Professor Fig said anything? No, Professor. Nothing more, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that She's regard, a one, I've asked she? your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Uh, da, 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 da. Professor Ronan mentioned it. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily okay. to assign your first one. Sure. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade, After I mentioned the assignment. Earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. That's right, I'm still using a borrowed wand. You've managed wand. your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand. I think you'll find it's not going to make a superior. difference. Um, I'm ready to go. Can you tell me more about the potion shop, Professor? J. Pippin's potions stocks a wide array of potions ingredients, although they rarely sell recipes. Professor Sharp asked that they have a couple of particular recipes on hand for you. So Professor Sharp must be potions. I still do not know what Professor Fig teaches. I cannot fathom what it is. I've never heard of a spellcraft before, Professor. What is it? A spellcraft is a recipe of sorts used when conjuring objects. I shall explain more about them when you begin working with transfiguration magic. Mm -hmm. Okay. There's an Ollivander's in Hogsmeade. There is. Most people are familiar with mm. the shop in Diagon I don't remember that he had one in Hogsmeade. We're fortunate to have someone like him nearby. Mr. Ollivander is a genuine craftsman and highly skilled wand maker. I would trust no one else to pair me with a wand. I like how I've unintentionally picked an eye colour that matches her outfit, her uniform. I was just trying to figure out an eye colour that matched the rest of her, so I'm, I'm glad that it pairs together nicely. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. 
I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Imelda or Perhaps Natty? Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. Yeah, Natty. I've noticed you spending time with them. How about Natty? Oh, should I go with my own housemate? Nah, Natty. I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is one of our most talented students. And she knows the area. She'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? Victor Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, okay. including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow. And you let students you go there. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. Okay. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. I can't assume I have money to afford that lady. Revenia. Speak to Professor Ronan to... <sighs> Summons the types of quests given to you by Hogwarts professors that, when completed, reward you with new spells. The reward for completing your first assignment will be the Mending Charm Repair. Oh, I can go back to that bridge. Where was the bridge? It's by the Great Hall, wasn't it? Which is required to complete other quests. You can track assignments and other pro... Yeah, cool. The bridge! I'm pretty sure you need to repair it. They, they just look broken, is what they look. Now, was it good to... Hello. To choose Natty, or should I have chosen Spashin since he was at my house? But I like Natty. She's fun. Did you, see Claire's hair? Quite a you guys are quite gossipy, you know. The color of oh, dear. There's not one week gone by I haven't had a howler from my mother. She's you guys go... You don't interact. You just speak at each other. This. You don't follow up on the same tasks. Offered to carry my books, he did. I haven't been feeling myself at all. But what That's happened what then? What did he do with the bag of books? Professor Sharp asked me what the ingredients Okay, you guys don't you guys don't talk to each other, you just speak at each other. Everyone oh, else at least had a conversation. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor? Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that, the mending charm Repero. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. We will have you casting Rapero in no time. Okay. Why must I first complete tasks to learn Rapero? No lesson or lecture can compare to first-hand experience. And these tasks should provide you with just that. Okay. Such experience is invaluable when mastering any new bit of magic. I buy it. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Okay. Collect the flying page near the broken statue. Collect the flying page of the fence against the dark arts. Okay. Oi! 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 Get here, you. Got it. Okay. And then this one. 30, 28 feet up. Okay. Did I miss one upstairs? Flying page oh, there. Of Brilliant. Can't believe I missed it. That is adorable. You are. I trust the preliminary tasks were. How do people not trouble. like you? You're so much fun. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. Wish I had teachers you like you at school. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try, then, shall we? Okay. Remember My mouse is to ready. be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Vigor, yes, he says, Callie. Vigor. Remember that. Remember, your wand is Jesus. a conduit of your magic. Whoa! I wasn't prepared for the F. There you go. There's my vigor. I've got real vigor for you. 
really wasn't expecting the F. The mending charm repair can be used to mend broken objects and pieces of the environment. That's it. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. In the it alcove allegedly by symbolized the water. heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. Oh, it's really quite sad. Repair. Nicely done. Works like a charm, doesn't it? <laughs> ha, you're adorable. Revelio. Oh, I thought it'd give me something about her. Oh, we didn't even realize this water was here. Oh god, oh god, that is terrible. Another one of these statues. Lumos. Levioso. <gasps> That's what I do with it. Oh my god. Where were the other two? Are you kidding me? Where would Sir, where were the other two? I don't remember where they were. There? I'm a little turned around, I must admit. The school's confusing as fuck. This, where were they? Revelia. That's not it. I don't know where they were. I don't even know where I am. Where you am can't I? Imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. I'm at potions. That's not where I planned on being. Oh, we're back at the main hall thing in my bob. Okay. Where were those dudes? Where were the dudes? Revelio. I don't remember where they were. I've just gone in so many different places and I'm so turned around. I mean, I assume it was on my way to here, right? Wasn't it? Oh, in the bridge. We need to get back to the bridge. Well, okay. Let's just start here. I found the bridge. So you need to be repaired. Repair. That didn't really do anything, I don't think. So you don't have to be repaired. Lumos. Let me answer. I don't know what your problem is, then. Repair. Okay. Repairing is not what you require. I don't know how to fix you then. Was it this way or was it back that way? Oh my god, I don't remember where it was. Where were these statues? Was this one in the corner? Yes, this one in the corner. You! I keep hitting one! Give me that. Revelio! Any secrets to be had out here? Probably not. And was the other one inside the building? Are you gonna jump me? What are you doing there, kid? Was the other one inside here? There was the second one in close proximity to the first. There he is. Lumos. Again with the... Let's get to level six. Still haven't finished the first main mission. Are you kidding me? I'm like, what, a handful of XP off? Rebellion. Uh, now you're just being nasty, game. Are there any side quests? Do I have to zoom into each individual section to find side quests? Will you just tell me about... So no, no, there we go. Gob of gobstones. Talk to Zenobia Noak. I get wand handles. Okay. I don't know if this is the closest uh, flu. What did she call it? Flu, flu, flu something? Either way, we're here. Revelio. God, the world has opened up to me with each spell I learn. This is revolutionary. Nope, down. Definitely down. Zenobia? Oh, shit. There was definitely a better one I could have taken. Hold on, we're not tracking the right quest, are we? Oh no, we are. Okay, okay. I thought gold was leading to the gold main mission. I panicked for a second there. We're fine. 
There she is. If only a new student were to help me with my sad predicament. You're younger than me, and I feel like you're emotionally manipulating me here, but okay. Are you alright? Don't you know who I am? Zenobia Noak. The girl whom everyone at school hates for no reason. I don't know if it's because of her previous sentence or her tone, but it sounds like she's a very woe is me kind of person. Everyone hates you? Why? Because Hogwarts is full of bullies and spoil sports. Leander Pruitt's one of the worst, that no talent moon mind. I wanted to make some new friends, and so I brought my collection down to the common room. My gobstone collection, that is. I was hoping someone would want to play. Are you familiar with gobstones? I'm not. Little balls, like marbles. Grand game. And if you lose, they spray you with a foul-smelling liquid. Dear God. Uh, okay. Gobstones. Sounds like a fun challenge. That's what I tried to tell everyone. <sighs> People can be so cruel. Just because they're sprayed all over with smelly gobstone spit, it's their own fault for losing. Uh, yes and Imelda no. Imelda is one of the worst losers. Ever written a story or a terrible Why well. are you playing with people so much and older than yourself? And now those losers have taken my gobstones and hidden them in very high places all over the school. Imelda. <sighs> Rather an overreaction on their part. I'll say. Anyway, I can't work out how to get oh, them back on so my own. Oh, we're not own. playing gobstones. I don't think I've I know the necessary spells them. yet. I need someone, perhaps a selfless and talented fifth year to help me. Like what, Akio? <sighs> Do you have any suggestions on how to get your gobstones down from their hiding spots? If I knew that, I'd get them myself. Whoever hid my gobstones that high got up there somehow. And Melody probably used a broom. Haven't you any friends at school? Not really. Natty said hello once, but not a word since. You're younger. You don't really make friends with kids younger than you that much. I'll see what I can do. I'd appreciate the help. If you do Although I find suppose in a stones, boarding facility you probably do. I'll be back but in normal to school you Snake generally don't. And Jack Stone by myself in no time. Okay, you do that, dear. Where are they? Six of the buggers. Well, at least you mark them out for me. So it's not really where I saw my day going, you know? Not at all where I saw my day going. I was meant to be going to Hogsmeade. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Akio! Well, that's one of Zenobia's gobstones. I hardly see what all the fuss is about. Don't tell her that. Revelio. Oh, that's right, we're back in this room. Uh, do you have a side quest oh, for me? What am I missing? It's Lenora Everly! I'm coming back. Let me finish this mission oh, first. Okay, let's run to go talk to Lenora. I, I need to... <laughs> I need to just get to Hogsmeade and finish the first main mission of the game. I haven't even finished the first mission. Like, I am terrible. Can I get it from that far away? No, I need to go a little higher, methinks. Actually, I can go higher again. Because there's a thingy up there. Yeah. Excuse me. Coming through. Oh, there is another one up here. That's the thing about Keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Okay, so we could have gotten it from there, but I went the other way. And you say we can go up again. How nice to see you, my young friend. Ignatia, I've had enough of you for the day. Hush. Ooh. Divination, you say? Sorry. I'm not going that way. Oh god. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We're going for it. We're going for it. We can see the sights of Hogwarts along the way. Revenia. Totally know where I'm going. Well, you did say high spots, so this does make sense. Hello. Ah, it's that waterfall again.
Where are we? None of those bloody butterflies I can do nothing with. I mean, yeah, it doesn't it doesn't activate as as an aimed target. Okay. Good view in your house elves. Hello. Oh, that's cute. Do you just casually have a broom in hand? Yes, she does. Revelia. I haven't been here before. Oh. Door. Door. Number one, please. One plus eight is nine. You need a four, which is... I can't even see that damn symbol. It's a... I don't even know what that is, but the funky looking symbol I can't recognize. That. It's like an owl on a branch or something? I don't know. 13 plus 3 is 16. You need a 5, which is again that funky looking crab spider. Excuse me. Oh, I get with the door coming out. Too impatient, that's my problem. A book stand. And blue solar protection goggles, which you say are an increase in stats. Do tell. They most certainly are. Oh, aren't you looking hip and fashionable, Callie? Hold on, did they have a trait? No. No trait applied. Never mind, never mind. Ah, the gobstones. Okay. Revelio. Anything else? Nope. We continue. I'd better keep an eye on the places tower. around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Uh, there it is. No one's wearing any eyewear here. Lumos. I Jesus, I want to trade those buttons so badly. <sighs> Couldn't you put L for Lumos or something? There we go. There's six. Oh, we get HP with our loved. Oh, hello, staircase. Revelia. Well, I am going that way, so thank you very much. Just don't collapse on me while I'm on you. That'd be uh, disastrous to the students. Thank you very much. Door! This is not why we're here, but whatever. Uh, you're two? Then where's one? Revelio. Ah, oh, there it is. Okay. Two is three plus nine is twelve. You need a seven, which is the bulbous looking thing. Bulbous looking thing, check. And then two plus 15 is 17 to 23 is six, which is going to be the lizard, I think. I don't really want to stop but actually check. I'm just going to pretend that's right. Ha! Didn't get hit this time. Ooh, well this is a lovely room. I like this room. I like the Ravenclaw Tower. Golden Snitch Scarf. And some cabinets. Is that a better scarf? It's a level seven scarf. Oh, so I can get gear beyond my level. Interesting. Oops, challenges, challenges. One or two assignments. Well, I haven't been given the second assignment yet. Complete three side relationship quests. Well, I'm gonna do what's the faces, um, Lenora's afterwards. Her name was Lenora, wasn't it? Lenora Everly. So hold your horses. That will get us two. Plus Zenobia's gobstones, I mean. Ooh! Or did the wizarding that words are the dueling. Did the dueling count as the first one? This is counter count as the second one once I complete it, and then Lenora's is gonna be the third? Mayhap. 
I've Rebellion. always said that travel broadens the mind. You would, Miss I created the flu network. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's cobstones. Uh huh. Trophy room. Oh my gosh, there's so much to see and do in the trophy room. Goblet of Fire casket! The Goblet of Fire rests within this ancient jewel encrusted chest. The Goblet has served as a means of selecting champions from the Tri Wizard tournament since the contests, contests, Jesus, contests establishment in the late 13th century. And then there was another one. Rebellion. This one. This room contains the House Cup, Quidditch trophies, dueling trophies, and other awards given at the school. Students who step out of line can be found polishing the silver here by hand as a reminder of the value of hard work. Good on them. What are you? Hogwarts Herbology Award. In recognition of exemplary skill in the field of herbology, Hogwarts bestows a special award upon seventh year Hufflepuff Mirabelle Garlic. <gasps> Is this the garlic? The current professor? From Mandrix to Mistletoe and Bubitus. Bubo tubers to bouncing bulbs. Her work with Flora has exceeded all expectations. Did we just steal them? We've got to stop stealing shit. It's not really acceptable. And that's locked. Rebellion. But that is not. Byzantine beret. And didn't you activate? Yeah, there you go. House of armor. The set of armor for House Elf is ruined to have been made by a cruel wizard who wanted his elf to protect him in battle. Happily, the wizard was too dense to realize that armor could, in fact, be considered clothing. Ah <laughs> The moment the elf donned it, he disapparated right out of it, never to be seen again. That is genius, sir. Positively genius. Rebellion. Look, there's a lot of shit. Yeah, see, there's a lot of shit here. We've got to, we've got to check everything. Centaur armor. This unique set of armor was created as a misguided peace offering to a centaur leader. The gift was spurned and the messenger shot through the leg with an arrow. The armor itself, battered with hoof marks, was later recovered and refurbished. Huh. What do you know? What an interesting part of history. Did miss anything, did Rebellion. I? Oh, it's just a flute. Oh no, it's just dude here. Off on another adventure, are we? Troll armor? This unusual suit of armor was crafted for a troll. That it has survived at all is astonishing since trolls do not ordinarily wear armor. It would understandably be prone to smashing it in confusion or anger. You're not wrong. Oh my god, I passed you entirely on the way in. Wow. Money. Okay, well we picked up a beret. Which is surprisingly better. Ah, uh, but you have a trait slot. So I don't know what traits do yet. So until I do know what it is, I should probably avoid it and just take the stats, right? Right? I think right. Right. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's oh, corpse. Wait, hold on, there's another one here. Where? Oh, there it is. That's the last of That's six for six. I should go and see her. Can I just interact with these? Be a lot quicker if I could. Now, which one is she actually closer to? I'm going to say that one. Probably wrong. But either way, it's closer than where I'm currently standing. So I'll take it. I was hoping that would work on him. Oh, there, that's the chest I can't find. Never mind. That's charms. I know where I am. Revelio. Kind of, but not. Yep. Excuse me. Come through. 
Here goes Zenobia. I hope you've had more luck than I did tracking down my gobstones. Indeed. I managed Hello, to attain Zenobia. all six. I found all of your gobstones. Really? I didn't think it was possible. However, did you do it? Accio, my Common friend. Sense and basic magic. <laughs> well, <clears throat> that's kind of insulting to her. I have my gobstones back. Yes. You, you, nah, bitch, I'm keeping them. No, 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 of course of you can course. have them. Of course. They are yours after all. Be oh, thievery if I took them. I shall dedicate all my future victories to you. God, Speaking see, she says I'm mocking. Now that I have all my gobstones back, I wonder if anyone in the common room would be up for a game. I mean, wonderful idea. Uh, you might lose them again, though. I mean, good on you for trying, though. I'm sure they'd be willing to play after the trouble spent getting them back. I don't it's think so. It's a fine so. idea. I think Isn't it's a terrible it? idea and you're going to lose we'll them again. we'll have so much fun together laughing as all the losers get sprayed, which won't include me. And I'll have so much fun finding well, them again for you. Very well, off I go. Wish me luck. Good luck, because I'm going to have to find them again. Woe is me. Ah, yes, okay, so that counts as the second one. So if we go back and find Lenora Everly, that should be three, four, three. Lenora was in here. Okay, so aren't they supposed to show up? Or is it not there? It's this one here. Oh, is that what the black means? The black mean that there's a mission there? There's two here. Cressida has one as well. Potions classroom. Oh, God. That was not the closest flume I could have. Flu network thingy I could have gone to. This one is. I'm trying to V my way to success, but it's okay. It's fine. Lenora was here. Lenora! There's something in there. I just know it. <gasps> You're going to teach me about the butterflies! Hello. Yes. I don't believe we've met. Oh, hello. I'm Lenora. I'm never going to pass them by ever again. Pardon me if I seem a little distracted at the moment. Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. But it's this painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more You mean the this. butterflies appeared out of nowhere? Okay. Have you gained any insights about the painting since you've been studying it? I did discover that casting Lumos has an effect of some <sighs> kind. But I'm not sure what to do next. Okay, we must, but there's a second step. Are there other empty paintings like this around the school? There are heaps. Yes, a few. This entire place is somewhat of a but riddle. The is that I'm never going to go back on foot again if to find them all. If I can work out the riddle of this one, I'll know what to do with all of them. Correct. As good a place as any to begin. You are correct. Okay. If I have the time, I may look. Could be intriguing. <sighs> I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. I only know four spells, five spells. Okay, Lumos is here. Come and find me if you stumble on something illuminating that solves the mystery. Lumos. That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. Find the location depicted in the painting. Okay. I mean, sure. Are they all going to be close by? This that looks like nice. the location from the painting. Oh. What could be so special about it? Let's get you back to your frame, Miss Oh. Morph. I see! And they're not butterflies, they're moths. I'm so sorry for mischaracterizing you. In you go. In you go. <laughs> I knew there was a connection. I should tell Lenora that I sold Lenora. the puzzle of that empty frame. This one was quite easy. Oh shit, it disappears. You get Lenora, it's disappeared. But I hit level 7 and I still haven't finished the main mission. <laughs> Lenora? I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? I followed the clues. I found the location depicted in the painting, and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. Pity I was so close to solving you it. You were, you got the first step. You have a knack for solving riddles. Natty's good at that too. So is Amit, although he does tend to overexplain. I don't know Amit. Is well, he a fellow half someone figured it out. You're welcome. The moth. I should have seen that. Combat regalia? That's combat regalia? 
If you say so, I'll take your word for it. Challenge complete. 4% and we haven't gotten anywhere. Did we not get gear? We didn't get gear. I'm so confused. Why didn't we get the gear? Oh, we can just change the appearance. Holy sweet baby Jesus. I so need to wear that at some point. It's hilarious. <gasps> I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to look at your drawers. Okay, someone else here has a mission. Someone in this vicinity. It was Cressida. Cressida. Oh, you're upstairs, aren't you? No, you're downstairs. Now I need to find all these bloody moth puzzles that I've completely missed. Oh, you look very down. I really have made a mess of things. What did you do? Give me a sec, actually. That's so cute. Look at the little baby dragon. Anyway, what have you done, Cressida? Cressida? Is everything all right? Call it Cressida. Oh, hello. Thank you for asking. I'm Cressida, by the way, and I'm afraid everything's not all right. I may be in a spot of trouble with the librarian. <sighs> Where is the library? I'm creating my own charms. Thought I'd perfected my light as a feather charm to use on my library books. My arms get so tired carrying them around all day. Have you considered a bag? But I must have confused the Latin word for feather with bird in my incantation. Because when I opened my bag just now in the library, they literally took flight. Oh, that sounds brilliant, actually. Thank you. Somehow I don't think the librarian will see it that way. So I've got way. to get rid of the birds? I collect the books and remove the charm myself. Except this isn't the first time one of my charms has threatened the peace of the huh. library. Our meat told Sounds Madame like Scribner problem, they were my Cressida. books flying around. So she said that if I caused her any more trouble, she'd write to my parents. Perhaps you could get them for me. There are only five. She won't be suspicious of a new student looking around. Okay, great. I'd like to know where the library is. I mean, why is Amit being a, a bit of a douche nozzle? Why did our meat tell Amit, Madame Scribner sorry. that they were your books? Oh, to be perfectly honest, I don't think he meant any harm. I think he was impressed, bragging on my behalf. Oh. I mean, spends a lot of time gazing at the stars, but he knows a good charm when he sees one. I see. I suppose I could help if I have the time. Oh, I'd very she doesn't sound much very convincing. <laughs> one of the books is my diary. If I have to I'd rather oh. not fall into the wrong hands. Hello. If you could collect them and bring them to me, I can remove the charm. Collect Cressida's flying books from the library. I don't know where the library is, so this is going to be great. Oh, this is the library right here? Oh, down here. I didn't want to go in. I'm going to have to use Accio to get to those books. You are, but I'm just looking at anything else magically inclined. Professor Black, might I suggest a ban on magic in the library? Someone has been sneaking into the restricted section and Cressida Bloom seems to think of the library as her own personal arena in which to practice her latest incantations. It is most disruptive. One might consider Peeves tame by comparison to such antics. Excuse me. Come here. Got it. I need four more to go. Come here. Can I do it all from where I'm standing? Oh. That wasn't one of the books. <laughs> Whoops. Rebellion. Oh, it's just back here. Yung. But how to get to it is the question. Is there a puzzle required to get to it? There most certainly is. Hmm. It is beyond my ken, I think. Very much beyond my ken. Okay. Floating books, you say. Floating books. There are none here in the main hall. Yoink. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. And this Rebellion. must be the restricted section. Locked. Okay, upstairs. Yep, there's one. Over yonder. Oh, this is so discombobulating. Oh god, ouch. Where did you go? Oh, it's downstairs. What? 
after all that work, getting up here. Did I miss it somehow? Rebellion. Yeah, I am missing it. I am blind. This must be Cressida's diary. Ooh. I'd want this back too if I were her. Today was a good day. That is, until Gareth splashed whatever ridiculous concoction he was creating all over my perfectly stewed lacing flies. Had to empty my entire cauldron and start all over again. He's such a menace. Thinks he knows everything there is to know about potions. Always disrupting Professor Sharp's class with his experiments. I'm utterly convinced that if he wasn't Professor Weasley's nephew, he would have been expelled by now. Our broeth smokies again tonight for dinner. I'm becoming partial to them now, although I still prefer meat pie. Okie dokie. Oh god, this staircase is making me dizzy. In reality, it'd be fine, but just, oof. The mouse is, whoa, it's killing me. Now, where is this other one? Hey, excuse me? You were here two seconds ago. There you are. Come here, you dastardly book. <gasps> We're still short one. Does anybody see a flying book? There it is. I'm like, I'm sure it's going to be on that side. Get here. That's the last book. Now to take them back to Cressida. The old librarian. One of the first librarians of Hogwarts is depicted here. Rumour is that he had no tolerance whatsoever for noisy students and was known for the liberal use of his silencing charm at the slightest sneeze. That seems like a bit of an overstatement or a dramatic Rebellion. thing indeed. Okay, there's nothing to Revelio over there. Anything to Revelio over here? Probably through the floor. No. Okay. Fair enough. There is a chest here though. <gasps> it's a moth puzzle! Lumos. That's in front of old mate. Old mate was back this way. Excuse me, guys. I need to go obtain this bloody moth. Come here. Excuse me. Moth on the way. Moth on the way. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Yoink. Right, now we can leave. Bling. Revenia. One of these days, that's gonna do something, and then you'll thank me for spinning every wheel I came across. Oh, my head. Please don't make me do that. Ah, oh, my head, it hurts. I'm so dizzy. Whew. Oh my god, it's divided by Latin? Well, that's science of some kind. Wait, that was outside. Oh no, that's just words. They were outside as well. Cressida. I did it. He, you're about to be banned. Any luck finding my diary and the rest of my books? Hello, Cressida. I collected your books, including your diary. Oh, what a relief. Thank you. I'll happily take the heavy lot off your hands now. I absolutely did not read your diary. Perhaps a reward to keep the diary secret. Bribery. No, 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 no. Here you are. Well, lesson learned. I certainly won't be practicing any charms in the library. I don't again, think the librarian soon. will let you. <laughs> now, to work out where I went wrong. Well, Perhaps you... I should start brushing up on my Latin. Yeah, you said that you used the wrong word. So, yeah, working on your Thank Latin would be the best thing. Some people are trustworthy. You're welcome. Certainly wouldn't want anyone but me reading my diary. Yeah, with the content you put in there. I'm not surprised. Um, I know that I want to live, I want to learn the un forgivable curses because I'm pretty sure you can learn them in this game but that doesn't mean I have to be a bad human being all right I can I can be a good person and still use them what did we gather I don't know it must be an appearance of some kind oh the wand <laughs> I'm ahead of myself apparently oops 